what is going on y'all welcome back to forza horizon 5 this is it this is the finale episode thank you guys so much for the love and support all of the encouragement all the kind words all the comments the likes uh this this has been such a fun series and um today's episode's a fun one I'm really excited. Today we finish out the rest of the five little stories that popped up throughout the series. Um, when you hit Hall of Fame, you get right. to finish them. This is a post credit scene. That's what scene. we're doing today. And according to the call sheet, Victor wants uh, both of you. <laughs> both of us. He doesn't know I exist, right? I thought we hid it from the director. I guess we didn't hide it well enough. Yo, look at this thing, though. The two this looks like Action. this looks like a hey. Tesla with off-road tires. What do you say we make this one real? This is nuts. Oh, you know it. See you at the finish line. Try to beat I Frank. Guess this is what we have been working towards. The within made manifest. The conflict real. The outcome unknowable. My greatest work. <laughs> uh, clever was it? <laughs> These dudes. Yeah, I like this car. I have no idea what this is, but this is kind of fun and it's kind of fast, especially in the off-road. But uh, yeah, today's episode is, is all about finishing out the stories, uh, sort of resolving the unresolved parts of, of the episodes. Like I said, when you hit Hall of Fame like mode, it unlocks a bunch of different final versions in all of these different stories that you've been following. So here we are in the V10 series that we were doing earlier where we're a part of that movie set. We'll be hollering at Carmen, taking photos. We'll be hanging out with Ramiro, doing the Lucha Libre stuff. Just kind of going through all of it. And it's pretty dope. And we get to finish out with a big old jump in the truck. I like treat. it. And that, with any luck, is definitely positively a wrap. So, Victor's asked me to join his remake of Rendezvous. Turns out he saw the thing we did in Edinburgh. It's a huge opportunity. And all thanks to you, kid. Actually, you know, I've got this idea. Uh-oh. It's about twins who fight crime. What do you know, Frank? In cars. I'm in. Tell me more. <laughs> Three stars, baby. Only, only a minute and nine seconds, but uh, fun to finally sort of close out that chapter of the book, and uh, we get a wheel spin out of the deal. Are you kidding? Give me 300k. I will take it. I will gladly take it. So let's take a look at the map here. We just finished the V10 story. Speaking of, oh yeah, we get something from it. We get the Frankie Beaumont costume. That's hilarious. That is wild. If we were to do all... All of those chapters on three stars, we get the yes go. That's kind of tempting. We may have to look into that in a uh, in an off off stream episode. But that being said, we're keeping the story aye, going. Aye, hi there, all Let's of holler favor, at Carmen. Eh? Woo! Hey, no shouty. time to explain. Vente ya. Come hey, shouty. <laughs> Thanks, Carmen. Is this about the book? I told you guys last time. Hi, ah, there you are. So I worked it this out. This relationship's Remember a little interesting. Flood? She was near an abandoned church along a river. And that has to be the temple of Quechula. Andale, vámonos. Drive. Let's get it. Look at this freaking truck thing. Claro. This thing is nutty. Ford Ladies Velociraptor, I think this is called. Marvel to show us and the double rear, show rear, me how rear a axles. Drives, no? Nuts. Wasn't the temple at Cachula flooded? I didn't bring my snorkel. Ay, <laughs> que chistoso. Cachula is located on a flood plain, but after a long dry season... The temple is accessible. I take it Yo. back, let's go. Yikes. Into the trees. That, that turn was way sharper than I thought. This thing's pretty dope though, I'm not gonna lie. I'm not I'm not a huge truck guy like in real life, but I don't think I've ever seen a like a double axle freaking beast thing like this. This is crazy. Oh, I can tell you it has zero turn radius though. Oh my god. This thing does not turn. <laughs> Especially when you're going as fast as we're going. It does not turn. Alright, there we go. There's a little bit better. We need to get down into that presa. Uh oh. Down into the reservoir. 
I love it. This is pretty cool. I feel like I've never even seen this part. There should be like a race down here. It just feels like that's a missed opportunity in the game, right? We're out here looking for photos. But other than that, we should be in here racing like regularly. Maybe it's uh, just part of the story where it's dried up. It's usually a river. Maybe that's, maybe that's part of it. Oh, big time air. There we go. The truck handled it like a tank. No big deal at all. I love it. Yeah, I... Coming up on the church. Oh, yeah, que rápido. This church is 500 years old. It was built in the hopes that oh, it would cool. become Look the center thing. of an important city, but never did. In 1966, the dam was built and the whole area flooded. Wow, look at this thing. So I'm looking for the statue. Can I see it from like a certain angle? Like up here? No, it doesn't look like a statue. It's just the side of a big old church. See, it's not out there. Is it around the back side? No. It's hard to it's hard to drive and free cam it, because it's a little it's a little sensitive to free cam, but. I don't see anything in there. Wait. It's the statue. It's a small version of one of the tall. A small version? Let me jump into photo mode. Is it in the wall? Oh, wait. Hold on. He's there in between the rocks. Look at that little son of a gun. There we go. That's what we were looking for. We got to make sure we get the truck in the shot, too. There we go. Line it up. Line it up. Perfect. Perfect. This is amazing. Like a final chapter of the book I never got to read as a girl. I, I hate to say it, but it feels like this belongs in a museum. I agree. But you know, it won't be visible unless you go see it at exactly the right time. <laughs> you don't believe that, right? That's so funny. Only two stars for that one. Carmen, I feel like... So, I don't know. Tristan there's won't some, race you until you're in the hall of something fame. going on there. Well, do you want to tell him? Oh, we got to deal with Tristan. Him. We're waiting for you. Remember that son idea, of a gun? Jay. Meet us down there. Oh, you're going to lose this one, him. Tristan. Hey, you two. Calm down, Jay. So, Tristan, shall we finish this? Tristan don't want these hands. Hey, Tristan. Ford fast. Hey, you were supposed to beat them, not join them. In the Lotus. I think we're racing the Jaguar F type that we won earlier. Yeah, the one with the green dot, or it was a green car with the white dot on the side. It reminded me of a, uh, of a billiards ball. It's pretty funny. I'm tired of these stupid dudes. Creating a group call now. Thanks, Yo, you okay? What's going on? Tristan Westfield Bourne speaking. Guys, you two should have been best mates, not worst enemies. So we're gonna fix that right now. Well, if you think I'm going to group therapy while racing, you are quite mistaken. Jay, anything you want to say to Tristan? Uh, look, I'm sorry, all right? I'm sorry I called you Bourne Rich. That was me. Tristan, that's your cue. I'm sorry about all Very of this. Nice. Anyone else, I wouldn't have cared. That's a sweet sentiment. We get to spank Tristan's ass while they make up with one another. This is pretty dope, flying through, uh, flying through this city. I gotta say, even though I didn't spend a ton of time here, this might be the coolest biome in the game. It's definitely the highest amount of detail. I think the sound is cool. The sound design sounds really unique as you go through these streets. Um, it's unlike any part of the racing experience that you have anywhere else on the map. And I think that's pretty cool. So, big fan of this portion of uh, of Horizon Mexico. I really am. Zooming through the streets. I don't know where Tristan is. I'm blazing him. I'm blazing him. I don't even have to, like, floor it. We just got to do our thing. There we go. There we go. Yeah, just, like, listen to the sound. That's sick. That's 
that's sick. As you rev it up through the through the town, the way the audio and the you know the noise bounces off these, you you really feel enclosed. It's pretty sick. Yes, that was epic. Now who wants to go back to the start line and make it best two out of three? Right. Now we can get back to street scene without all this drama. Okay. Both of you. Absolutely. But can I just say that drama led to the sickest race series in Horizon history? Yo, Tristan, come to Street Scene this weekend. I'll introduce you to everyone, but you still have to pretend like we still can't stand each other, okay? <laughs> I get it. But I want to drive that Aventador of yours. <laughs> Tristan wants to whip it. Three more stars. And we're having a pretty strong episode so far. I'm pretty happy about it. And check out this thing. I had to finish the episode strong with maybe the coolest car. The Audi R8 with the custom monster paint job. The two-tone matte sponsorships all over. I don't like sponsorships all the time. But that I one's a cool one. Hey, hey. Ramiro. What is it, Ramiro? Uh, no. It's El Monstro Fantasma. The monster ghost has returned. Uh, El what now? I'll send you a link. This is a classic storyline. Uh, look, just come to Guanajuato. Pronto. El horrible monster ghost is oh, back shit, from decades storm, in exile. After an epic defeat by El Campeón and El Forzudo, they cannot face their ancient enemy alone. They need an ally. Oh, snap. We get to erase the monster ghost. I wonder what the monster ghost is. Oh my god, look at this storm. And we're inside of the city. Oh shit, it's the big monster truck. Oh, this I can't believe it. This dude. This dude. El Campeón. We're, we're Toro Loco. Oh, Loco too short. Taking out some poles. Shortcut. Oh, I see it. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, we found that. Beautiful. Dude, look at the weather. This is a gnarly storm, and, I mean, it just looks fantastic. I mean, it's certainly slick, like, I feel it. Oh, shit. It's my guy, El Forzudo. He took out a pole and almost hit me with it, but, yeah, look at this storm. I feel like it's going to pick us up and swing us around somewhere. Uh oh, through the tunnel. Oh, my God, we can't see anything. Okay, knock out. Oh, and then the audio changes. I just, so many great little nuggets and details I'm a big fan I really am come on come on sharp corner coming up sharp corner Ooh, there's a good little drift I got it done I like it never lost control amazing oh, I don't even see the monster truck anywhere <laughs> Basically, the announcer saying it took all three of us to beat the, the big monster truck. Hell, I'm blazing all of them. I don't know what they're talking about. I'm blazing them all. I don't need nobody's help. Dang, it's like getting legitimately dark outside. You guys see that? Like, I haven't touched any of the settings. I'm seriously, I think there's about to be a tornado. Like, what is happening? Jeez. Yo, the cameraman the even getting blown around. We the triple alliance. Together, they can drive away a terror like the monster ghost. I cannot wait to see what bouts of lucha de carreteras await us in the future. We smoked him. He doesn't want these problems. Three more stars for you, boy. Yes, sir. I love it. Okay. Saludos again. Ale. Remember our stock versus scratch race where I beat you by about those millas? <laughs> Not how I remember it. Papa Fernando said a racer should be their own mecanico. Well, I have the ultimate test. Mm. Come and meet me. 
Intriguing. What? Do you have planned, Ellie? <laughs> nada, nada. Well, I did get a hold of a bare VW Beetle chassis, and I have built something from scratch. Papa Fernando would probably think I've gone a little bit loca. And you've got a coding zig here too, because. Because we're going to race them, of course. This time vroom, I get stuck and don't hold anything back. Nice. Back in the Vacho. Dang, she gets a sports car. Yeah, 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 the Koenig thing. I think that's what he called it. Oh, this thing's quick. We're both fast. Uh-oh. Oh, we leveled up, level 99. Oh, big chilling. Love to see it. Oh, the red smoke looks fantastic. That's so cool as the sun sets. Mountains in the background. Clear sky. Dang, I can't catch her. Yo, Ale, why are you so damn fast? I'm flooring it. I'm going 200. I let off the gas because it looked like a turn. She didn't take it at all. Okay, there's a turn. What do you think of my Skyper Bocho? <laughs> I think you set this whole thing up just so you can say hi for Bocha. <laughs> Maybe I did. If you like, bring your Bocha down to the auto show sometime and I'll show you how to customize it. Nice. That'd be cool. That'd be super cool. Yo, I can't. I was going to say, okay, good thing we passed her there. She hit the brakes a little too hard. I got the slingshot bonus, but goodness gracious, she was hard to pass. She was leading like literally half this race. Oh my god, oh my god. Bacho, chill. Bacho, chill. Come on, come on, come on. Dang, she's, she's keeping up with me. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Can I cut her off? Nope. Shit. Uh oh. Can I even catch her? Are we really still two miles away? That's what the destination marker says. All right. Luckily, we're on her. Oh, she's trading some paint. I'm racing her like she's a villain, but she's usually pretty nice to me. So I shouldn't be so mean to Allie, but hey, I'm not taking no L's, brother. Damn, running off the road, though, is what I'm doing. Come on. Oh, my God, again. This thing is quick. It doesn't turn very well, but it's got a ton of acceleration. Not not a very good uh, combination for us. Oh my god. Come on, come on. Oh, it says 1.2 miles, but the map says much closer. Okay, we're chilling. Brilliant. We're chilling. Well oh, and mi familia has organized a small exhibit of Papa Fernando's things at the outpost. You should take un vistazo. He sounds like a great guy. I wish I'd known him. Papa Fernando, rest in peace. Three more stars. And guess what, y'all? That's officially it. That's officially it. Man, I'm so grateful for all of you guys. Check this out. We hit up pretty much everything on the map. I mean, I've got some stuff hidden, but all the major story points, knocked out all the chapters of the Vacho, the V10, uh, Luce Libre, we hit all the test drivers. We hit the Born Fast series, all the showcases, Carmen, El Camino story. That's it. We got them all. We got them all. That is, that is Forza Horizon 5. What a great game. Level 99 as we wrap up the series. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. I've had an absolute blast playing this game and learning how to edit and make content around this game. It's been so much fun. Um, be sure to like and subscribe if you guys are enjoying the series, the channel in general. I appreciate you so much. You know, we gotta, we gotta, I gotta hit you guys with a little uh, celebrate, celebratory donut as we get out of here. All these cars, we gotta burn, burn one out. I love y'all. Be safe, take care of yourselves. Until next time, peace.